Hi everyone, this is Chris Thurgood from My Girlfriend's Quilt Shop in Logan, Utah. And we're here on another Tuesday for Machine Tip Tuesday. And so today we wanted to show you a little bit more about a special foot that is really going to do wonders for your binding. So I'm really excited to show you. In fact, let's see, I'm even in my, I'm even barefoot right now. Can you believe that? <laughs> It's at the end of the day and my feet are tired and so I said I got to just take off these shoes But anyway, so we are here with Barb who is our machine expert around here <laughs> And she's going to show you a little bit about the edge joining foot. Is that right Barb? Edge okay, edge joining foot and I can't wait for you to find out more if you have any questions along the way Please feel free to let us know and we'll have Barb um, answer. So let me go ahead. All right, Barb, here we go. Okay. Hey, how's it going? It's going really, really good. It's Tuesday, the end yes, of the day. That's right, at the end of the day. And we're going to take a look at what you're, what are you working on? I'm going to, this is just a little mini quilt and okay. I'm sewing on a crescendo, okay. which I really, really love. Mm -hmm. And what I'm doing is putting the binding around it. So I'm sewing it to the back. This is the front. Okay. And here is the back. So I'm just doing a quarter inch seam All right, so around the back. Mm -hmm. I'm going to turn a corner here in a minute. So I'm going to sew to a quarter inch from the edge, cut my threads, and then I'm going to... This is kind of how we normally would do right. a, a mitered binding, right? Exactly. Okay. So what are we doing now, Barb? Now we're going to drop the foot. Oh, okay. Well, let's take a look. That was pretty easy. Oh, it is. <laughs> Want me to put that back on again? Oh, you know, just for kicks and giggles, we might as well. <laughs> there you go. Show how simple it is. Going to drop the foot. Wow. I'm ready for another Okay, foot. fantastic. All right. This is the foot we're going to put on. It's the edge joining foot. Edge joining foot. Love it. Okay. Love this foot. I've worn two of them out. <laughs> I use it so you much. You use it all the time. All I do. Right. I'm also going to change my bobbin out. Now, what, why are you doing that? Because this is, well, I just had white in, but I, even though I'm sewing on red, because I'm going to put my binding on the front. Okay, so what you're doing is you're going to show us how to do the binding on both machine. the top uh -huh. and the bottom on the machine. Because I prefer to do that. If I'm going to wash this quilt and wash this quilt, yep. I want it to be a strong binding. Okay, I can see that. All right. And now I'm going to just pull this over to the front with my, I should show you this right here. Right on the bottom of that foot is a little lip. Let's take, let's see if I can get a, is that good? Okay, yeah. And that lip is going to hold my quilt where I want it to be. So I'm going to put that back All on. Right. See how easy that goes on <laughs> and it. off? I do too. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to just cover up. I don't pin, I don't anything. I just cover up the stitching I had before mm -hmm. and see how I'm lining the fabric, the fold of the fabric up with that foot. Now I'm still in my, qu my quarter inch seam, so it's just to the right of that lip my needle is. Okay. Sorry, and I'm, I'm going in to your way there, Barb. <laughs> and I'm going to just sew that down. Now the reason I'm using invisible thread on the back is that I don't want that stitching to show. Even though I'm putting it on oh my the back. Goodness, I can see already. Do you love this? Yes. Look how nice and straight that is. Wow. <laughs> that is. <laughs> that's fantastic. Now look how straight it is back there. Yeah, this is great. Isn't that right wonderful? Here. Yeah. It really is. And when I get to the edge, I'm going to sit down like this a little bit. I'm going to lift up my foot. And with my stylus, which I totally love. No, it's too wet out there. Yes, my stiletto. <laughs> sorry, I called it the wrong name. 
I'm just going to sew right up to that point again. I like that kind of, you know, acts like a very long hand, right? It Here. is. And it has little grippers on it. It's textured. Oh. This is the Stiletto by Annie. Okay. So I'll hold my fabric in place. Oh, that's fantastic. Is that slick? That really is. So I'm going to take a look at this nice... Oh, yeah, the corners looks great. And you can see, see how, how I can pick mm -hmm. it up and move it. Exactly, I love that. I love that. Any questions out there as you're watching this? Does anything come to mind that you're thinking about? Any questions that have to do with binding or how to use this foot? You can use this foot for lots of things, right? Or I can. I do top stitching with it all the time. Mm -hmm. That really gives a nice finish to it. And I turn around mm -hmm. and I'm right in the right spot. See, now no, it's getting a little no pinning or anything. And I do entire big quilts. I mean, this is a tiny one, but I do the whole thing like this because mm -hmm. I don't like to hand stitch. Well, like you said, especially for quilts that you're going to be washing and that are going to get a lot of wear and tear, um, I, I think, especially for baby quilts, this is yes. the way to go. It's actually machine binding, um, you know, the whole thing. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. Any questions? It's kind of quiet out there. All right. Well, Barb, thank you so you much. You are welcome. <laughs> Just and stitch away. As you're watching, if you do have any questions and we haven't answered them, uh, this video stays on all the time. So we'll be happy to go back and answer as we go. So, all right. If you enjoyed that little machine tip, from Barb today, give her a thumbs up or show her some love <laughs> <laughs> so you can say, yes, you did it. And they're out there watching. So, all righty. I just love this. <laughs> I just love this. Yeah, I, I do. do too. Oh, you need to see the back. Oh, okay. Because we did that, uh, we used invisible thread, clear thread. You really can't see where oh, that was. Oh my goodness, no you can't. And it works on anything. Wow. I love it. That's fantastic. That looks really, really good. Are you uh, surprised? <laughs> no. <laughs> Not surprised at all. <laughs> all right. Thanks, Miss Barb. You're welcome. All right. Goodbye. We'll talk to you next time. I think.